stages. And the first stage is this. It's a time of discovery. It, the first stage is a time of discovery, okay? And that is roughly about birth to about age five or six or so, okay? And now, anybody got kids that age? Any, anywhere of studies? Yeah, you go, what are they discovering? Everything, fingers, toes, mom, dad, the world, all of they, man, rapid, amazing things happen in zero to five. They're in a time of discovery. Then, about age seven or eight to about age nine or 10 or maybe 11, they go from discovery to the second phase of human development. Y'all with me? Here we go. Second phase is this, it's testing. <laughs> Here we go, yep, okay, it's testing. I mean, now, they're testing. What happens if I ride my bike off the roof? What happens if I, you know, you're, in, you're in the hospital, kids this age, you're in the hospital with them all the time, okay? Matter of fact, we were about to book our own room at the hospital, okay? And they're, they're testing. Now, the question is this. They spend five to six years discovering, what are they testing? They're testing what they Previously discovered, what works, what doesn't, who's me, who's not me, and then it's awesome. About age 10 or so, they move into the third and final stage of human development, and this is awesome, okay? Age 10 or so, they draw conclusions. Discovery, testing, and they draw conclusions, and that's why the most secure people in the world are 10 years old. The, mo <laughs> the most, the happiest people in the world. They're all 10 years old, okay? Why? They've arrived at full childhood. It's Friday night. They don't have a date. They don't care. They're 10, okay? And they're the happiest people in the world until one tragic thing happens. Puber bingo. Puberty hits and whammo, wipes the entire thing out. And here's what happens. They come swinging into they come swinging in adolescence on the, tra on the trapeze of childhood. Puberty hits, they let that go. Can they become an instant adult? No, and this is huge. They have to go through the same three stages to become a full adult that they did to arrive at full childhood, okay? And so it goes like this. About ages 11 to 13, they go back into a time of? Discovery, okay? It's middle school. It's junior high. They're, that's why they're so up, down, up, down, up, down. They're discovering. Oh, do you think I'm cool? Do you think I'm cool? Do you think I'm cool? It's Anybody want to go back to junior high and relive that? They, it's crazy. I mean, they gotta, that's why they have a boyfriend at breakfast, break up at lunch, new one by dinner, okay? I mean, it's, it's out there. I actually love this age group, okay? Junior high was one of my favorite things I ever did, okay? The, um, because you can get them excited. They'll run through a wall. You gotta go first, but then they'll follow you, okay? And then, so they're in a time of discovery, up, down, up, down, very insecure. Then, about age 14 or so, to about age 18, they go from discovery to a time of testing. What, anybody remember those, going through those? What are they testing? Oh, good way you say everything. God, rules, limits, you know, I mean, dad says, be home at midnight. Kid comes home Tuesday just to test what's gonna happen, okay? And then they go through this time of testing. And by the way, you know the problem with the church? We'll come back to this in a minute. The problem with the Christian church has been this. God has wired them to test. Our message to them is don't test. We should be shaping what they test, Okay, so they test things that'll lead them in good directions instead of testing things that'll wreck the rest of their life. Make sense? Okay, we'll do a whole session on that uh, in these 14 things we're gonna release. The, um, and then about age 19 or 30, <laughs> they go through a time of conclusions. Now, why is this such a big thing? A teenager, okay, the puberty hits, they let go of the childhood trapeze. They can't reach the adult trapeze yet. So what's a good definition of most teenagers? Their feet are firmly planted in midair with nothing to grab onto for security and starving for a solid foundation. Yeah. Makes sense? Number one, start with stability, okay?